Hey YouTube, small post today. You know I came, probably in a walk from Japan. Uh, some stuff I bought on eBay and it wasn't too expensive. Uh, it's 100, should be 100, 400 scale uh, gas atom figures, Gundams, uh, which I will be repainting. And we will talk to you sometimes in a pass here. Uh, but I'm gonna repaint them uh, and use them in tabletop gaming. And there's a mecha top miniature game coming out. The Kickstarter funded successfully last year. Uh, it was supposed to be delivered around now, but there's uh, some slight problems um, in China with production. So if that happens, Christian Explorer worthy. Uh, still available, I think, through a backer kit. Just look for Mecha Top. But it's a uh, rules for all kind of mechas Grandizer, Transformers, Gundams. You can put them all against together. And uh, considering. I am playing with the idea of doing a 50mm scale with the 144 uh, high grade model kits. Uh, but probably be for demo purpose or something. For the common games, I'm going to go for these gas phones also because it between $2 and $10 if you order them in Japan for uh, depending on the chase models, regular models. Uh, Popular suits, rank and file suits, obscure suits, uh, whatever. Got quite a heap of them already and now I got a whole lot more. Well, it should be about six. So let's see which ones we have. But I know which ones we have with you then. And let's have a look in this little tiny pub bag. Bubble wrap, bubble wrap, bubble wrap. The first one I have here is the Noble Gundam. So, um, well, hello. I'm gonna take my cheat sheet for a moment. Forgive me about that. But there are uh, some coming up in this list that have like really exotic numberings. Uh, uh, but this is no kind of wielder from uh, the G Fighter series. Uh, that's a pretty cheap one. It was two dollars. Then this is also a pretty common suit. It's a Gaza C but in the Hanum Karn. So it's gonna be fun to repaint. Jeez. It's a pink and purple one. So and the rules give me just the guys I see. Uh, you know, right, uh, even if you want to make your own car, that's the great thing about the mega top. You can create your own suits. Um, and Gundam's really good come out if you do it uh, custom time between 5 to 700 points. Standard game is 1800, so you usually have 3 mobile suits. You can team them. Uh, I even made a list with four suits, but it was like really to cox and a guide and that kind of stuff. Then of course we have a Justice Gundam, the X09A. Uh, it's the companion suit to the Freedom. So, yeah. I just wanted to have this one because companion suit to the Freedom is always a good thing because we also have... Where is he? Where is he? Here he is. A Freedom Gundam. I'm not gonna unpack them all unless the uh, fire is in front of it, but uh, when they get painted up, I will be um, showing them on this channel, as usual, with the painted figures. Uh, got an RX 78 and a Charles uh, Super coming up soon, up soon, whenever I get around to uploading them. Then I have uh, another, well, pretty common suit, uh, it's the other one that I'm gonna find, and that is. Uh, I am totally free, but sometimes you might need less points, and that's where you have the strike. Does it uh, already show which is my favorite suit? <laughs> <laughs> and then the one where I'll actually open my uh, well, eBay listing. You can't see it because on the other side, but uh, and because it's a Zaku one, but it has the da -da -da -da, so it has a power axe and everything. The marking fin rear. So, there are a couple of Zaku ones out there, and it's the small shield here on the side. The markings that differ them. Which is quite funny because it was a less common set and it was uh, cheaper than the usual ones. So, there are probably people buying them and having a lot of Zaku grunts. But um, those were the six suits I got. And I can't say when they will be painted up. It will be not next week, it will not be next month. 
but it will be as soon as possible because actually it's the only thing that I need painting but as you can see behind me black curtain there that's my 3d printer and uh, I need to change extruder assembly I just need a, a week off from work to actually change the whole extruder assembly line them out and everything and that sounds silly because I need that printer to print my hexagonal bases. I'm gonna take an example of one of those pink ones. So you see the wall moving. I'll take a, a closet, an old drifting closet of Nashis, which I uh, enlisted. And I'll take one of these figures that already passed. So this, here we got the uh, Gundam wing, basic wing Gundam. And it's these bases that I 3D print because you need a hexagonal base for hexa top and I can add uh, marking for the front and the back art to it so side is a 3 paint is simple to uh, tone, color but it has a bit more detail and depth than the gas font so that's why I do that stuff and it's war game and war games are played with uh, painted figures so let's bring the wall back and there we go Gundam unboxing. More mobile suits. <laughs> I was just going in a big box with a lot of Kessa fonts. One 400, uh, one 300, I got a lot of skills. So, uh, been for uh, quite a lot of gaming and one I do. I tried to film a solo game. I uh, never filmed battle reports because I'm not uh, versed yet in the editing thing and everything of YouTube. But uh, we'll see how that goes. Thanks for watching. See you.